apparently the rapper Des D or Dad got himself into some real trouble and I don't mean just a speeding ticket or something like that. He was charged with doing something absolutely terrible and he was charged with assaulting a 14 year old girl. And what's even crazier is the day after the incident happened Des D and her brother showed up to evict the girl's family out of the house. So I did get this from Hollywood Unlocked and it says Alexis Elise, hopefully I'm pronouncing it right, is demanding justice after Atlanta rapper Des Dior's father was charged with SAing her 14 year old daughter. Disclaimer, the alleged assault and arrest happened last year, however the mother is now speaking out days ahead of the reported January 22nd trial. Gerald records show that Daryl Lawrence Bailey, the 51 year old father of the 25 year old Atlanta rapper Destiny Bailey, famously known as Des Dior, was arrested and booked into Henry County Sheriff's Office jail on February 27th of 2023. He was hit with five charges, the R word, statutory R word, aggravated S word, aggravated child M word, and aggravated S battery of a child per the North Carolina beat. Bailey remains in custody without a bun as of Thursday, January 11th. Elise told the outlet that she met Bailey in 2022 at a Savannah Home Depot where both worked as forklift drivers. They grew close enough for her to lend Bailey money which he had paid back. In January 2023, Elise tried to leave a man she was involved with and Bailey opened his home up to her and her children. The following month, Elise alleged that one morning around 5 a.m., Bailey R. Word, her 14 year old daughter. So it continues and says after the alleged incident, Ellis, who was two hours away, Fort Funeral said her daughter called and told her everything. Rushed into the home, Ellis called 911 to meet her, afraid of what she would do to Bailey once face to face. When officers arrived, they took the girl's clothes and bed sheets, but didn't arrest Bailey, which infuriated Ellis. On February 27th, Ellis learned Bailey was in custody and she was free to return to his home where she legally established residency. But Ellis said her and her daughter's fingerprints used to access the home were deleted from the system. She also alleged that Des Dior came by and insincerely apologized to her daughter, stating, I'm sorry what happened to you. The next day, Ellis said the rapper and her brother returned to the police trying to evict them. They showed what Des' dad was booked under. They also showed a picture of Des talking to her dad when the police arrived. Now, people in the comment section, of course, shared their opinion. One person said, this my thing and y'all may not like this. Des apologized to this woman and her child. I don't think it's wrong to cut all ties and ask for them to move out. She didn't have nothing to do with her father trifling ways. She don't have to shelter them. I feel like the mama trying to get over. Who wants to stay in a home where their child was R word at anyway? Someone else chimed in and said, y'all refuse to read. Des tried to kick out the mother and daughter instead of holding her trifling dad responsible. Someone else said, I'd evict them too. I'm sorry. I don't want ish to do with any of that. You shouldn't want to stay in the house you have PTSD from anyway. This person said, hear me out, but if Des owns the home and her father is fighting the charges, I think it's only right you leave the home. You've only been there for a month before it happened and let's just say he was to beat the charges. Legally, he would go back to his home, right? Moving is definitely the best option. But you guys, let me know your thoughts and opinions on this down in the comment section below. Do you guys feel like Des is wrong for trying to evict the mother and daughter? Let me know down in the comment section below and how do you feel about this whole situation. Make sure you guys like, share, subscribe, hit the notification bell and I will talk to you guys in the next video.